Who that? 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 Who you right, guys, my name is Living Dead 69 and welcome back to my Madden 15 Ultimate Team series with my team, the London Brawlers. Completely fucked up. Quick look at my team. Got uh, Kaepernick at quarterback, Madden season though, so he's going to go down. Solid O Lion, tight ends as well, tight ends as well, tight ends as well. Can't moan about Blunt and my receiving core is solid even though they're low ratings, so I can't knock them. Deep. Um, defense is pretty solid for the level that we're at. Buchanan, even though he's a 72, is a monster. Just need to work on the defensive tackle and the leftover linebacker, really, just so I can get some more pass rush and better coverage. But yeah, current season records one and one. Need to get a win out of this to help us avoid the motion. He gets kickoff, which is not what I wanted, but you just got to deal with what you're given in this game. And he kicks it straight out of bounds. That gives us a little bit of addition, but yeah, coming out of addition, but yeah, coming out of the split back formation, we just missed Baldwin with the pass on first down. We go for another pass on second down, but the blitz just doesn't get picked up at all. So yeah, third and long. Not really liking the way our play was lining up against the defense. So we cycle through a few of the audibles until we feel comfortable with it. And it works because we find Evans over the middle and he gets us the first down. So yeah, first and 10 from inside their 20 and we almost give the ball straight back to him. We panic because of the pass rush and just, oh. But yeah, third and 10 we go for a play action and Kaepernick just ends up in this glitch. So yeah, we get sacked so we'll just take the field goal. Defense does well getting him to third down but we just leave the seams wide open and he punishes us. And it seems we don't learn our lesson because he goes straight back to it even with man coverage and he still gets it. But yeah. We almost jumped this little curl route right, as he's in our red zone, but Buchanan comes up with a massive hit there. And we accidentally run commit on third down, which gives him the touchdown. So, yeah, can't really complain about that. Great play by him. But yeah, we call the play action on first down, which leaves Jones wide open on that post slash Z route or whatever it is. And um, gain a nice pick up there. But we go for another play action and we bottle the throw and the pass rush gets to us. So couldn't get anything going either so we just punt the ball back to his two yard line and Buchanan saves a certain touchdown there without a doubt but third and ten and he goes back to basics he hits us up with those golden curls man just defenders weren't quick enough to react but yeah and he hits us with the little out routes as well so just can't get anything going man but we sack him on first down leaving us a little bit of time possibly stop him and get something going but yeah he goes for the seams again and as I said 72 Buchanan just snatches that ball great interception gives us a great field position and enough time to possibly do something but check out this triple option he reads it with both guys but Blunt shakes one defender shakes another defender and I shouldn't have ran to the sidelines there but I was doing my best to try and get the touchdown but yeah going into the second half I feel we got the momentum even though we're not winning this game yet but yeah and this is what killed me First play of the second half and we could have come up with a touchdown. But yeah, we hold him to third down. His quarterback goes nuts and just as he's about to scramble, just manages to get it. But yeah, second and 14. We hit Evans over the middle again for a nice 25, 30 yard pickup. But yeah, we get tunnel vision on second and six and we just eyeball Jones. And he somehow comes up with it in double coverage. Don't know, yeah. you know? but yeah. And he holds us to third and seven, but the play actually leaves Baldwin open in the end zone, giving us the lead. Held to third and 12, and Mr. Primetime himself comes up with his first pick of the day. And we keep it in their half, so we've got great field position to go up again. So yeah, Jennings like shakes one defender, shakes another defender, and comes up just short. But play action on third down leaves Dressen open on the drag over the middle as we take the game into the fourth quarter. And feeling we got the momentum, it's like we'll just throw one up, and yeah, we throw an interception. <laughs> So yeah, there's not much we can really do about that. That's just a poor read by me. So yeah, we need the defense to step up. And they do actually. Like we read that it's gonna be a post for the tight end. We just can't get the pick. Third and two, we stuff his run. Buchanan up to Buchanan coming up to make the tackle. And Mr. Primetime again. Jumps the curl route, second interception of the day. And we're back on offense. So can't complain. It's been a, it's been a solid game. We just we're just not really just not really making anything. But Baldwin, like we read that it's his own play. We pick him out in between four players. Can't really complain about that to be honest. Um, 
and yeah, we can't get anything going, so we just get a field goal out of that. Not, I'm not gonna. I'm just gonna take my points wherever I can now. But he goes through on fourth and 18, and we read it over the middle. Nice user int there. So um, yeah, and we just try and run up the score now, and it doesn't work. Miss time the jump with Evans. All goes a bit uh, peaked on. So um, yeah. He lobs it up with one play to go, but I'll let you guess what happens with this one. Yep, yeah, missed the prime time for his third and final interception of the game. Uh, it's a pretty solid game, we just couldn't really execute. I feel the scoreline, we deserve to have more than 13 points, and he probably deserved to have more than seven, to be honest. But it was a close game, good battle between offense and defense. So you can't really knock it, really. We needed that win. So I'm not going to complain about it. But yeah, as you'll see, we just need one more win to avoid that level demotion. I do not want to get demoted on this game. So yeah, let's move into the next game. We read the screen on second down and he doesn't throw it. So we get him to third and 21. He makes an 11 yard pickup, but he goes for it on fourth, fourth and 10. And Newman comes up with the interception, which is a mistake really, because we had great field position if we didn't actually pick that off. So yeah. And check out this bad read. B is wide open, but we panic and throw it to A and we give him an interception and he's got even greater field position than what he had when, when we picked the ball off. So, yeah. But I, got, I had a feeling this guy was going to go for the screen seeing as he went for it straight off the bat and we almost, almost picked off the screen there. But this is just poor defending. One missed tackle, two missed tackle. Level him, fumble out of bounds. So, yeah. But look, look at Butler. Reads the foot. He reads that it's going to be a flat... And boom. But will he make it for a touchdown, though? Because linebackers aren't that quick on this game. You've got Olsen, who's catching him up. But we've got Kaepernick coming back into the field of view. He's one of the fast quarterbacks. Uh, no. No, he can't stop him. He just can't stop him. But yeah, after a few dink and duck, a few dink and dunk plays, send a bit of heat. And we almost come up with a snatch, but defender just couldn't quite read it. Third and nine, he had the tight end open, but he panics and he tries to go back to the running back and he can't do it. Again, he goes for it on third down, um, not third down, fourth down. And the seams, the same problem we have from last game, just come back to bite us on the ass. But yeah, what a catch. He pulls the screen, but throws it to the receiver who makes a great driving catch. And for some odd reason, he got kicked for excessive griefing. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this episode. I am going to try and change it up a bit to make it a little bit more watchable. But I hope you enjoyed it. Hit that like button. Remember to subscribe and peace.